Is it? Amos's third house, aka. Oh a my gosh, it was a cave! No! <laughs> <laughs> if you won't accept my Ten Commandments, I will go to the nuclear bunker! <laughs> Um, stay away. New code lock added. Don't the tell them is... it's a code, because now they're going to go break into the city hall and, like, find the code. But this also implies that we, Carol, are a bum, which I really appreciate. <laughs> oh. One, two, three, four. Get that weird-looking fruit. Pick it up, pick it up. Pick... Nope. It goes back in the weird backpack. The amount of weird backpacks that we have seen is a little disturbing. Uh... Beautiful. Uh-oh. And it's... So now we can use the key that we don't have? Crap. Run away before the alarm goes off! <laughs> oh no, why? What?! <laughs> Jonas, we're stuck! And now it's purple. <laughs> it's purple! I have to find the fossil table to do that. Meet me here later. Oh my gosh, we get to see him like 50 <laughs> times! A bottle of... Absolutely, we can... We... Uh, how much? <laughs> how much is all we need to know? We can load the whole jug there, probably. <laughs> I brought a tanker truck. No way. What do you mean? You, do she you doesn't want to give her wine away. How could she refuse to share? Do we have a bottle in the fridge that we didn't make ourselves? Ah, uh, unfortunately not. Just more breggit and whatever the frick everything else is. You need a pantry, Carol. <laughs> She has enough plates to host a party, but she also needs friends, so that's gonna be a uh, tricky one. She has one. two. Three if you count Big F. Ooh, I didn't know this existed! <laughs> Go away! What was that? Was that a uh, frickin' apron or some kind of naughty dress up time? I'm pre. I don't know. Alright. Well, she might not be here. For some reason, we're allowed to go see the building, even if Stina doesn't now. exist inside. Yep. <coughs> Which is completely odd, but... So I, I spent some time trying to figure out where the frick am I going to get wine if Carol's going to be greedy? Yeah. As in, how, how could she... Ethanol. Are we going to give him gasoline? Uh, where does he live? Where are we trying to go? Here, I think, right? Yeah. We're just gonna empty our car? Into his... Oh, for F's sakes. Oh, we're just gonna tell him that... Naughty, no? naughty! <laughs> Maybe you can help me with something else, then. Oh. I need to find the person. Is it the one that we're looking for? It's my brother. We don't care. This was his last known address. It's probably still there. Alright. Tina, thank God we caught you. You were on break. Why did you change clothes? <laughs> sure. <laughs> it seems like he's changed his name. While you were out, I just spilled gravy all over myself. <laughs> Well... Yes. Uh, yes! Is that pertinent to your investigation? You have no idea. Actually, we just wanted to rub it in your face. Bye! <laughs> She's not here now. She just disappeared! <laughs> She's <laughs> under the table! I can't see her! Alright. That did annoy me one time, because I left too quickly and I wanted to reread something she had presented. And she was already gone. I was like, come on, Stina! <laughs> as soon as Carol's gone, she just runs away. About that I would. guy, Ellen. Oh, yes? I just remember that he lived in a caravan at Lindenfield. 
like 50 years ago. Matter. That's a miracle. Wow. I don't even see a single building here. What the hell? Running through the field. Are you absolutely kidding me? Did someone shoot at him? I don't know. They don't explain why it's a wreck. Elam, I hope. Who the hell is Aina? I heard that they trashed your trailer. I'm glad that you found a new one. Isn't it this one? I haven't heard from Amos. Maybe <coughs> we can meet up at. You'll find me outside the liquor store with the thirsty sign. Oh! Maybe we can still get him some wine. I bet Carol knows exactly which liquor store she's talking about, too. <laughs> when I'm done drinking my 20 gallons. Oops. Alright. And the new trailer. Or the old one, I don't even know anymore. Equally as disgusting. Good job. Do we... Do we... We'll have to put in a battery? No. That's weird that the cursor moves down as I click. Holy <laughs> crap. <laughs> yes! This is what we've been looking for the whole time! <laughs> Amos, you've been putting out gospel quizzes? And guess who has to take it? You are absolutely kidding me. I this is why we watch VeggieTales, folks. <laughs> for moments like this. What is that? Prash. Um, honestly, no clue. Oh. It holds... Bird seed? It might be a hummingbird feeder. Ooh. Well, he got this place to himself. That's for damn sure. <gasps> I want... We're Elam Ploger. <laughs> We're gonna get me some of that free meal. <laughs> Thanks for the poem, Jonas! <laughs> I don't know if that means that, uh... You love us, or... You're abandoning us? I, uh... Not good with poems. Now that I've noticed there's like so many secrets to discover in this game that they just threw it, I'm kind of checking this area out to see if there's any random paths I missed. The eggs is right there? Since when? Okay, I found these magazines and pine cones. That's the only interesting thing here. Unfortunately. Okay. Gunner's dead. That's. Is it Jonas? orange now? Yes, your phone. Oh no! Charged I think he's ready. done! Oh. It's it, green. I said it would be green at some point! <laughs> Jonas, you are probably blackout drunk, so this is the time to say we love you, and you won't even remember. Bye, Jonas. Until next time. One more that means the That pretty much means the game is almost done. Unless Tina's back. She's not here now. Nope. If Stina comes back, you know there's like an extra hour left. <laughs> just like, I forgot about the second mystery! Like, <laughs> Stina. Stina would do that. Oh, really? What about? We know it's you? Pretty sure it's him. I was. Oh, yeah. He's dead now. Great! He used to be an active church member, but wasn't able to combat his addiction. I blame you. I think he lived in a trailer. Of course he did. He was friends why, with Amos. Why they weren't just all parked up next to the church is beyond me. Back in the 80s, him and Amos put together a quiz based on Bible verses by the Pelican Lake. For the Pelicans? It's still there. The signboards have been repaired several times, though. So what, is it now a trivia about, like, baseball or something? I guess we have to go take it and find out. Hopefully we brought the rowboat. Welcome to Gospel Quiz. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can get a copy of the children's Bible. 
Do you take out all the swearing and stuff? <laughs> Wait, what are we supposed to remember here? The verses. Are you serious? Mm-hmm. Can, can you do that, or should I? Up to you. Mm, okay. There's Peter. So this isn't mu so much as a quiz as it's the game of memory. Oh, it's the one that we just saw. Wait, the where one are we putting the two feet away. I. Is there a board over here? It... Wait, did that even come up? Hang on. Who do we tell this to? Can we just tell the ranger that we saw, like, that the Bible is in us the whole time and we win? Oh, it's completely unrelated to anything that's here. Well, yep. good to know. Ah, uh, where's the thing that needed the code, though? I... Oh, wait, the phone, phone that Jonas gave us. His phone, yeah. What was the code? I, I wasn't looking either. It's like right. one three two seven, or maybe it's one three seven. Set the house in case it blows up. Good call. <laughs> maybe we'll take out the landlord. <laughs> we still need to take out the landlord. One three two seven. Maybe I said that. Maybe I didn't. If you are forced to leave your house, you can always come by and stay with me. You can you check young man's hoff sometime in the next week. What else? End. That's one word. You can find the key beneath the tree to the left of Martha, as usual. Love the bee. Okay. We need to go find that key that was left by the bee. Uh, at where it was Jungle Manaf. Let's see what we can see. Hee hee hee. It's been a while since I saved. Just in case. I don't want the game to collapse and we have to do like an hour over again. Oh, is this the place where we put in the key? What the hell is Martha? Oh, we don't know what Martha is. Ah, uh, uh, I came here too early. Martha is my favorite bee. Where do you think it is? <laughs> have you moved from your chair yet? <laughs> no. That was nope. my sister. Awesome. She's she dead? dead. The gazebo. <laughs> That's supposed to be funny. You ask some strange questions. We're just gonna dig her up. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now I didn't remember where the, the the gazebo was. You mentioned once. I think oh, it's here. No, you're right. It should be. I mean, this is the closer location. It's just in the back. That's in, in a the weird. Woods. I get the feeling it might actually be at uh, Kruganov or whatever the other place is. Uh, yep, it's it, not here. Crap. Okay. They are both on the map, so... We'll make it work. Yep, this is the right spot. Because we go to the scary place, and then we turn in, and it's, it's the gazebo. Awesome. Okay, the key is in her mouth? No. Oh, the tree! Trowel it. Oh, a shovel. Keep shoveling. You can keep. Thank you. That's for the weird oh, box in the scary place. It's for the weird box in the scary place. Okay. Fine. Which one was the scary place? Oh. This scary place. Red, green, blue, yellow. What? Oh. It was Let's just get him in the right order, and now you get a key. Thank you. Uh, now I need to remember where the key's for. Probably not the scary place. In fact, actually, wait, I bet I know. Is it Jahani? And the front door, right? <laughs> sure. 
<laughs> Sorry, we're playing Knights of the Old Republic all of a sudden. <coughs> I can't pronounce that long name, so I just guess and pray. Love my old sanctuary. It's a small white house made of clay behind where the old Fiskeby station was. It has a hook in the ceiling where you can attach a punching... That's a punching bag. <coughs> Look at the shape. It's bag-shaped. Yep, it's a bit too big for the ball. Lazara? Who drew this? Did you let your child make a map for you? <laughs> Ours? Nope. We're not ready to kill people. We have too much dangerous oh. stuff. <laughs> that would be for a protest. Hey, oh it's my... his fourth house. <laughs> it is his fourth house. We haven't even gotten into the bunker, have we? I don't actually know. Channel Fairy Disaster. That's How's this useful? It's worthless. Ugh. Another box? Why does it only have five numbers? Who's that gonna trick? That thing is weird. I think I just had a stroke. What the hell just happened? Three... Lots of numbers. One, nine, and three. Maybe this can be open somehow. No, I can't. Shut up, Carol. We'll do <laughs> something else. It's a clue open this thing. Let's assume it's three, nine, one, nine, three. I think I should close. It's, uh... It could, it's either three, nine, one, nine, three, or something very sim... Oh, it was two at the end. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Jeez. Oh, sure. The expensive watch and the expensive ring are worthless, but the key. Where's the key go to, Carol? The bunker. All right. What? Because we have the code, Why? but not the key. Is it still open? Please be open. That'd be nice. Well, let's find out. Dang it, it locked it again. It doesn't unlock. It will if you put in the code! I'm so glad you remembered. <laughs> Pretty have easy. Two when different light sources. Pretty easy when that's the third time I've had to put the code in. What? An extra door? And scary MK music. MKMJ? The Bible with highlighted numbers. 1927. Okay. Make a note of that. And now. Oh. Oh. And now we step outside and see. Cat was here the whole time! No, I'm kidding. No. Shucks. I, I mean, we haven't really learned anything important yet, have we? No. We also can we never have... go back to the boat. Oh, crap! That was most of the freaking map! Oh. oh. Oh, I got you. Oh my gosh! I actually didn't know that that was a different puzzle with its own puzzle inside of it! And what? that was back at Amos's like, fifth house or whatever. That's wackadoodle! I, I never would have thought of that in my life. I, usually when Carol says, can I open this? It's like, no! No, you can't, Carol! It the code is, is one nine two seven. Which one was the seven? That, that was one seven. A uh, third coin purse, no lock. And the news of your mother's death has just reached me. Please accept my sincere condolences. Uh, close relationship, struggling with drinking. She never gave up on me. A relationship came to an abrupt and highly unexpected end. I obtained a cheap ticket for a cruise to buy as much cheap liquor. Oh, Amos, you screwed up. When your mother found out, she went straight to my house by boat and tore my ticket. And then, as for the cruise, like five hours after the departure, the ferry started sinking. Oh my gosh. You basically got saved from the Titanic by Stina's mother, who then immediately died because she did one good thing. She, as I went into a drunken haze after this and was too ashamed to even contact her to thank her. Sincerely, Amos Green. Okay. 
But someone murdered him, right? I give uh -oh. up and go home. Everyone has disappeared from existence. I am concerned. I want my laundry. Damn it. The only mystery we can't solve today. I'm gonna hide in here forever. Isn't Wait, that a location from a previous game? Is that not like a Blue Madonna type thing? I think it might be. Oh, I never mentioned this giant AC that's on her desk now. That is a wall AC! Oh my gosh! It got too hot. <laughs> Actually, Carol, it was probably like, it's 60 degrees outside, so I had to spend $5,000 on a- oh, well. It's 23 Celsius, which is what in Fahrenheit? That's actually probably not completely comfortable. Alrighty. Still. Still. Convert 23 degrees Celsius to degrees Fahrenheit. The answer is 7.4 degrees Fahrenheit. That's a tolerable temperature. What was it? 73. Oh my gosh! <laughs> uh, maybe, I don't even know what the lemons she had on her desk were for. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Just spurt him in Stina's eye when we come by? Yes, please. This was it? That was it. A man should give an account of what happened to Amos. We have no idea what happened to Amos. He died. Why? Because he was drunk? Okay. Well, I guess I'll take that. Since I now knew that the troubled man was so eager to tell Stina, I considered... Oh. That's it! D d won't even remember who Amos is. Amos who? Moving on with my life. No one gets Stina's arrested. Life. We don't call the police. We literally just helped Stina. I feel really bad about that for some reason, but I guess there's nothing we can do. Now you know how I felt when I beat the game. <laughs> so now they say that COVID-19 is on his way out. Again. Not that you bothered to care. Ever. In this game. I once. believed it when they said the same thing last summer. Now I'm not so sure. Which means I didn't get vaccinated, wear a mask, I've been coughing. I wish it could have gone into such a quick and definite retirement as the lime trees outside my window. They'll be back, Carol. They'll give you all the limes you need. Why is it winter already? I wish that Amos Green found peace on the other side of his final repose. Never figured out what a repose is. Okay. So that's, that the, was that's the unsatisfying ending I told you about when you asked what I thought of the game. <laughs> he wasn't even murdered. Mm -hmm. There's no mystery. It was just Stina was like, we should investigate this. Stina has officially wasted all of our time. And Isn't this the second game Stina wasted all our time in? I think it is. Why? You know, we, we just... Take what we can get. Mm-hmm. Dennis Ploger. Well, thank you for doing the... Is he the, the guy who came up with the new engine? It might have been him. Hmm. Huh. Ego Venture. Which is honestly a weird freaking name for anything, to be perfectly honest. But you know what? This game worked perfectly. Yeah. Oh. It worked a lot, really... better, a lot better than when her interactive decided to change engines. Oh, a lot more um, legal terminology needed, I suppose, but... Mm -hmm. In case your game breaks, it's completely Ooh. your fault. You're welcome. Bye. <laughs> yep, <laughs> it just dumps us to the menu. Or it doesn't even jump us to the menu anymore. It kicks us out. <laughs> you play too much! Come outside! <laughs> Maybe we should. Wow, it, it, you need a lot less... Um, uh, memory space to record a Carol Reed game than a Sly game. A two-hour video is almost four gigabytes when that's like a 20-minute Sly video. I suppose so. A lot less is happening. And I guess we're done! I'm glad we got through that. Yeah. That was... That was... Uh, not... Not my favorite Carol Reed game ever, but... Mm -hmm. Still had a fun time with it. 
it's all you always have a fun time with Carol Reed. Very much so. Very much so. Meanwhile, in her interactive land, no signs of any new games for the rest of eternity. I don't even know if there's going to be a Valentine's Day contest. <laughs> yeah, they should have announced it by now, don't you think? Eh. You could win cookies! Yeah, <laughs> someone from her interactive will call and tell you that they're so proud of you. And give you no details about any games that have ever happened. Or will ever happen. They may try and say Secrets Can Kill again for 50% off. Gosh. And only the new one, right? Because the original one is so hard to share. Mm-hmm. Whatever. But we're going to keep doing Carol Reed games because they exist still. How many has that been? We're, I think we're at game 15 now, right? Might be. We'll see you next year for possibly number 16. Nice. See you back here for later for Sly! <laughs> Very much so.